Hi, everybody. My name is Sefer Davalu, and I play the piano. My friend Michael and I are both graduate students at the University of uh, Maryland School of Music, and we are so happy to present to you today a piece of music written by Rebecca Clark as a part of Ayuda's Helping Hands campaign for winter 2020. We have been working together on this piece this semester for our chamber class, Meaningful Connections. Thank you, Sefer. Hi everyone, my name is Michael Chong and I play viola. We are so thankful to be working together today with Ayuda to spread awareness of the current situation surrounding our immigrant neighbors. As the youngest child of a first generation immigrant family myself, I grew up listening to stories of my mom unexpectedly becoming one of the first members of my family to make it over here to the States as a refugee. It was through her resilience and surviving a month long journey out at sea on a steel ship with nothing but a single shoe in addition to bring her family to the land of opportunity and dreams that my family and I have been able to live our American dream. This year, the COVID-19 pandemic has exacerbated an already dire situation for many of Ayuda's immigrant clients and who are now facing an increased risk for homelessness, food insecurity, and domestic violence. Many of Ayuda's clients have reported lost jobs or wage reductions in their families and the many who still hold their jobs are essential workers fighting on the front lines, working to keep everyone safe. Ayuda has transitioned their legal and social services to be offered remotely and has expanded some life-saving services such as access to food and financial assistance to those most impacted by the COVID-19 pandemic. And it's that reason that we need your help today to sustain these services. In a time of deep division and isolation, Ayuda created the Helping Hands Campaign, a call to unity and support of our immigrant neighbors to ensure that our immigrant communities in the DC, Virginia, Maryland area get the services and resources they need as they seek to overcome obstacles and access to justice. In these trying and isolating times, it is important that the most vulnerable in our communities know that they are not alone. So, as we mentioned before, the piece that we are going to present to you is written by Rebecca Clark. She was born in London in 1886, but spent most of her life in the United States as a violist and composer. As it was very hard being a female composer in a field that was dominated mainly by men, she had to use the pen name Anthony Trent to be able to program her work. She was heavily influenced by composers like Claude Debussy and Ralph Vaughan Williams. The piece that you will hear shortly is called Morpheus, named after the Greek god associated with sleep and dreams. Rebecca Clark provides us with rich harmonies that evoke ethereal and characteristically impressionistic moods that don't follow tonal traditions, progressions, nor cadences. This piece creates an atmosphere reflective of a fantastical dream, and we hope you enjoy. Thank you. 
We hope that this giving season, you will consider donating to Ayuda's Helping Hands campaign to help provide the path to recovery for our immigrant neighbors in the DC, Virginia, and Maryland area. Please join us on this journey and lend a helping hand this giving season by donating where you can today. Thank you. Thank you.